So literally just passed some comics and some cool stuff. Um, I actually found something I was looking for. Um, a buddy of mine was like, hey, you can go online and find comics and all that stuff, da 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 da, -da. Um, But I enjoy the hunt. What up, everybody? Welcome to the start of the vlog. So yes, I'm gonna start doing vlogs now. So, uh, what up, everybody? Actually, outside of the flea market. I'm about to go inside here and see what we can find. So, literally just passed some comics and some cool stuff. Um, I actually found something I was looking for. Um, a buddy of mine was like, hey, you can go online and find comics and all that stuff, da 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 da, -da. Um, But I enjoy the hunt. Um, I was looking for some Maximum Carnage, trying to thin out shot my set, and he actually had some uh, graded 9.8s. Um, but I'm not trying to get into the graded stuff yet. That's a, that's a slippery slope. Um, but I was able to find this. I able to find uh, Maximum Carnage. I believe this is the the awesome conclusion, which is the final one. And then uh, the first issue, which I was looking for. So it's one and uh, nine, I believe. So yeah. I just came across these prints. Uh, it's a signed Keaton and Adam West. Got the Rick and Morty. Uh, I believe that's a Jason David Frank Power Rangers signed. Got a Eddie Guerrero, a signed Rona. Oh, a Stan Lee. Where does Stan Lee go? Stan Lee, that one's cool. left the barnyard now i'm at the old flea market and um i'll have to go in here and see what they got then i'll show you what i got from both places if i got anything here some old playstation ones some xboxes a ps2 mickey mouse Ron. Got Sega Genesis. Got the old DJ Hero stuff. So Mania. Top Gun, Ice Hockey, Blasters, Dragon Warrior, Blades of Steel. Oh, the PS1. That's an old one right there. Oh, you got a 64 up there. Volume 2. Animated series. DVD. That's what they say. I like the Pro Builder. The Mega Box are cool. Oh, I forgot they made a Sony remote for the old PlayStation. Got some AJ Jenkins rookie. That's really cool. Classic TV series. You got the Batmobile, Bicycle, Bicycle, and Joker Mobile. That's really neat. Xboxes, Call of Duties, Mini Panels, Motorcycle. Starting lineups. Bunch of guitars. We got a hawk. Oh, 
Ooh, Ninja Turtle. I did not see that. But yes, another snag. Batman Anime Series Volume 2. And part one, second season of the original Batman, Adam West. So that's a, that's a score right there for me. Okay, now, in a Welcome back to the vid. So now I'm here at uh, part of Fantasy Swamp. That's a really gorgeous out here. Look. The Spanish moss on the trees. I think out here is pretty cool. I'll turn this camera around so y'all can see this. Got a random porta potty right here. That's cool. Just a random porta potty. That's people out there on the boats. They're out there fishing or something or swimming or probably fishing. I don't think they'd be swimming. Not out here. I mean, you could swim out here, I guess. I wouldn't with all the snakes and random. Yep, no swimming or waiting. Strong currents. I'm going to put you back on the tripod. Walk around with y'all on the tripod. Minute while I walk around and kind of just explore a little bit. Got some foam coming off. Look at that. Wouldn't want to fall down in there, right? All the side. Ooh, that would stink. Fall off that, that wouldn't feel good. They got the one. They got the one, just the one gate open. Just the one gate open over there at the dam. No swimming, strong currents. Oh no, they got two of them open. Okay. I see this one down here. A little bit of a rainbow situation over there. Well, it looked like a rainbow. I don't know why there's a lot of smoke coming out from over there. Unless that's just off the water, but it looked like, it literally looks like smoke. I love the trees, the Spanish moss and the trees. That is a random bridge. But I'm a big fan of the Spanish moss and the trees. Hey, look at this. It's really gorgeous out here. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Grass is super high. Could be snakes in the grass, but oh well, who cares? I guess we're gonna try to walk over this one even though it's kind of messed up. We're gonna try to walk back over it. Yeah, it's kind of really gorgeous out here. Well, I'll take some photos. Took me some photos, now back over the video. Honestly, I don't know how safe this bridge right here is, but because I like doing dangerous things, we'll find out. Not very safe.
Ooh, the whole thing is literally. Ooh. Ooh. Because that thing right there is a little, that's a little iffy. It was creaking and vibrating, shaking underneath my feet. I'm just walking around in the grass, my shoes. I got on my black, my black uh, J's, my All Stars, and they're almost covered in yellow. So yeah, now I gotta remember how to get back over there. A little bit of fantasy, not really fantasy, the, the not fantasy swamp, but a little bit of the park area over here. Hear a bunch of planes coming in, so yeah, check out that short video. I just saw a really cool Delta flight take off. That was pretty neat. Yeah. All right, everybody, see you later. So I was leaving the uh, New Savannah Bluff Lock and Dam Park, and I happened to see something. And whenever I see something, especially like this, which is really weird. We're gonna check it out. So let me turn the camera on. I'll show you exactly what's going on. Over here, the new Savannah Bluff Lock and Dam Park. Thousand dollar fine for abandonment of animals. If you're abandoning animals, you're a terrible person, anyways. But that's not what I noticed. What I noticed is over here, New Savannah, New Savannah Cemetery, 1733, restored by the Augusta Committee of the Georgia Society, Colonial Dames of America. Oh, there's bees all over the place. Get away from me, bees. Oh, it says this beehive is under surveillance. Oh, there's a beehive here. Massive beehive. Wow. It's illegal to tamper with wild bees, punishable by five years in jail. Ooh. I don't want to do that, but this right here is what it says. Elizabeth Beale, 1772. I think you can go in there. I'm not sure. I am not too positive, to be 100% honest with you. Cemetery located about 200 yards from the mouth of Butler's, Augusta, Richmond County. I don't, I'm guessing that it's, I don't know. But there's a cemetery here. There looks like there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yeah, 13 graves. It looks like to be two child ones. 90, 1793 to 19. Eight, that's a little over 20, 59, 35 to 67, 66 to 67. So that was, she was only four. 1731 to 1819. Ooh. Number nine was a child. It looks like number, if it's one, two, three, four, and five are all young. 94 to 03. Yeah, that's old. It was young. L only two. Sarah Ware was only two years old. Brittany Henry Ware was only six years old. Joseph Ware. Joseph Ware was 70, 35. Sarah Ware. Brittany Henry Ware. So I don't know if you can go in there or not because it's under surveillance, but I had to come by and check it out. So definitely interesting. So welcome back. Now we're on Washington Road. Hey, Top Dog Comics. So let's go inside and see what they got. Let's go. Very quick. Good boy. Go. Chop of the hut. That one's clean. 65, 9.6. Secret walls. Young Avengers. Ooh, 
a Fantastic Four, it was a nice little Sentinel. I like the Kenners, the Captain America, Mastidio, Hulk, America. Got Dark Phoenix, Black Widows, some toy business, first appearance. First appearance, Dark Phoenix. Hulk smash. Got some legends, X Wings, War Machines clean. Spider Man, Spider Armor MK1. I like the Hobgoblin, but I've got that. I found that last year at uh, Joe Fest, so that actually worked out pretty well. Bunch more Marvel Legends, Marvel Legends, Marvel Legends. Really big fan of that Wolverine. I like the paint scheme, paint scheme, paint colors. Because they can be hit and miss. Marvel's King. Loki, I do like the Tesseract. One of these days. Spider-Mans do not like these boxes. You can put a hole in it right there, like they do the Transformers. So we would know if the paint is good or not. Don't like this one. Big fan of this one. I like the way they did that Moon Knight. Don't care for that one, though. Star Lord. Deep Space Homer. Robot Ichi. Uchi. That is really cool. I really like that. That's really awesome. Ren and Stimpy Super 7s. That is super cool. Super cool. DC Universe. Batman. What do we have down here? We have Batman and Robin. We got Pogo. Joker. We got Crime Squad. Ski Blast Robin. And then we got Undercover Bruce Wayne, which is cool, but the box is... Kind of messed up. The Killing Joke. If the backing was better on that, I'd do it. Animated Batman vs. Joker. Oh, it's a Walmart. Steppenwolf, Doctor Impossible. Hush. Batman Hush. The Joker's clean. That's cool. He may fix the new Batman Adventures. It's Miracle, Mantis, Cyborg. The Penguin's clean. Batman and Robin. Legends Batman. Look at that Moon Knight. I'd love to find that Moon Knight now. That's a dope Batman Warren Fourth scale. No, now I have to try to find this Moon Knight. Where was the picture at? So yes, I gotta try to find this Moon Knight. It's part of the MODOK series. So if anybody finds or sees that Moon Knight, let me know. That's what I need. I need the Moon Knight. We got Wasp, Wasp, Longshot, Baron, Falcon, a ton of Rick and Morty, a bunch of Rick and Morty, some Princess Bride, got some cool spawns, some cool spawn. Violator. Biting action jaw. Ooh. 
that one's clean. The clown. Transformers. Not a big person for Transformers. Ooh, Speed Racer. It's pretty cool. Wrestling figures. G.I. Joe, The Rock. One big fan of G.I. Joe's. So back here at the house and what did I pick up today on the adventure? Well Let's see. Let's see. Let's see What we picked up We picked up a couple of really old retro Mickeys Really old like original Mickey Mouses Got one Got Two and this one right here is really cool. It's old black and gray original Mickey Mouse's, which is really, really cool. Saw this in the video, but I also picked up Adam West, original Batman television series. Second part one, I had part one. I had part uh, second season, part one. I've got first season, so this one's gonna go into my collection. And I also found this really cool DVD set, Batman animated series. So that was pretty cool as well. What else did we get? Let's see. Boom. And then what else did we pick up? We got a couple signed photos as well. We got Michael Keaton, Adam West, signed Batman. Really cool. Got that Jason David Frank. Signed Jason David Frank. R.I.P. Green Ranger. And got a signed Tony Stark, Iron Man. Also found Maximum Carnage, last one, and first, first and last book, Maximum Carnage, which I was looking for. What else did we find today? See you in a second. Also picked up Amazing Spider-Man 403, Trial of Peter Parker, Amazing Spider-Man 254, love the symbiote suit. Picked up Moon Knight, High Strangers, Part 1 of 4. And Moon Knight, Face of Four Freedoms Plaza, Mark Spector. And then also got a pack of capstones and two AE dubs. So not a bad pickup. What up, everybody? It is Monday. I took yesterday off. Didn't film anything yesterday, but filming today. It's a Monday. Beautiful day today. A little bit of cloud, a little bit of cloud coverage, but nothing too bad. Hope you're enjoying all the vids so far. Um, sorry I didn't close out the last part of the vlog. Jesus, bees. Sorry I didn't close out the last part of the vlog, but um, yeah. Heading down to Mike's right now. Um, we're going to go try to find uh, these Georgia Bulldog tickets. Uh, yes. Not baseball, but not not football, but baseball tickets. Um, games tomorrow, Georgia versus Georgia Southern. So I'm gonna go try to find these tickets, and then we're gonna go from there. 
So hope you enjoy the rest of this video. Don't forget to hit that like for me, subscribe, notification bell so you're notified. And uh, most importantly, just love yourself, love one another. And uh, thank you all for supporting me in this crazy channel and on this wonderful journey. A lot more coming in uh, 2023. So hope you're ready. It's me and Mike. We're sitting outside of SRP box office. You can kind of see the box office. But uh, we're trying to get tickets for the Mars game. It says to come here. They're open until 5, but uh, two guys walked out in suits that weren't. I think they just walked around the corner. I don't think they walked around, walked out of here. No, it's all over there. Oh, yeah, yeah. over there. Two yeah. dudes walked out over there. They weren't too friendly, but they were like, oh, they have a staff meeting. I was like, well, do you think they'll be out by 5 o'clock? Because when it closes, they're like, oh, we don't know nothing. So I was like, all right. So we're sitting here. Still at Green Jacket Stadium. Got a pro shop. Got an entrance to the stadium, SRP Park. We're waiting because we're trying to get tickets for tomorrow's game. And, uh, yeah, want to see them dogs play some baseball tomorrow. So, I guess we're just going to sit here and wait until somebody walks out. Yay. So, we're just waiting. They said they're open till 5, so all we're doing is waiting. Yep, everything's closed. So, all we can do is wait. My plan is I'm hoping that my thought was like, okay, if they close at five o'clock, maybe somebody will come to the window and try to close up and we can get them. But um, yeah, stadium's nice though. Stadium's nice. SRP Park, beautiful stadium. They've actually gone cashless as well too. So that's pretty neat. But I'm hoping to get a ticket like right in this area right here. But we will see. Hopefully, they'll come out. So, let y'all know here in a minute. Somebody finally came in like we thought. Um, they only had, like, standing room only. So, it was 11 bucks a piece. We got two tickets for tomorrow's game. So, yeah. Persistence pays off. I knew somebody was going to be there. That's why I told Mike. I'm just going to wait, wait, wait. And finally, boom. Dude popped up. So, Georgia tickets. High roll. Let's go. What up? Yeah, so I'm got a Red Bull. We're about to go by Top Dog, which you probably saw in the other video or earlier in the video. We're in the Top Dog and Wally World. So enjoy. Top Dog comics. Amazing. If you're in Augusta, check it out. Let's go. We just got out of Top Dog. Um, didn't film a lot of next from the other day, plus those music. Plus, me and Mike were the only two people in there. And, uh, yeah, the musical plans. I didn't want to go too crazy. But did get a comic box. Got Venom. Um, got a few comics. We got some Power Rangers. Another Power Rangers. A Factor X. Age of Apocalypse. June. Another a Deadpool Wolverine. Had to get it because got a movie coming out. Got another June copy of X-Men. Another June copy of X-Men. And that's about it. Didn't get crazy, but it's pretty cool. And so we are heading to the uh, Georgia baseball game. So yeah, welcome to the vlog. Welcome to Tuesday. Uh, we're about to head to see uh, Georgia versus Georgia Southern at SLP Park. Should be a good game. We got $11 general admission tickets, so we'll be standing. We can roam around the stadium, which is cool with me. But it's going to be fun. So I have a lot of stuff coming to you from there. Have some footage coming. So, uh, yeah, love you all. Enjoy the video and see you in the rest of it. What up, fam? It's me, Mike, behind me. Yes, Mike's in Tennessee gear. I'm in Georgia gear. Just talked to a dude. I was going to the game. So you couldn't allow you to uh, pull into the stadium. So we had to find a spot. I suggested personally just walk over the bridge. Mike wasn't about that. So we found a spot over here, and now we're walking to the game. Uh, it's sold out, so this is going to be insane. Um, a lot of people are going to be here. So uh, I'll see y'all here in a little bit whenever we get closer to the stage. Just pulled by in a car and was like, yo, game he night. Had no idea. He was like, game night? And he was like, I was like, yeah. He was like, who's playing? Georgia versus Georgia Southern. He was like, oh, no wonder. But like, let me turn this around. Let me show you this line. Got people all over down the road behind us and we ain't even close to the stadium yet um this game is gonna be crazy i'm pretty sure the game's probably already started by now right 
635. What time is it now? Tell you in a moment. Mike's gonna tell us in a second. 634. 634. So the game starts in one minute. So we ain't gonna miss too much, but it's gonna be good. So see y'all in a minute. Boom. So now we're slowly making our way to the stadium. We probably still got half a mile maybe to go. Yeah, maybe three quarters, but it's going to be a good game. It's going to be a good time. It's going to be packed. It's going to be lit. So uh, wait till you see the videos from the inside. It's going to be insane. So we out here by the Brick Ponds. Um, I've actually done rando over here. Actually, I was over there at nighttime. Um, got the gator sighting warnings right there. So you can see the yellow sign says gator warning. But nope, coming up on SRP Park, everybody. Coming up on the game. So we've made it. We haven't made it to the gate yet, but we've made it. Uh, there's a lot. It looks like a massive line outside. But we'll eventually get in there. The lights are on. It's baseball season. And uh, like I told Mark, what better way than to kind of start the year off with some college baseball, right? Did I say Mark? My, my, if I said Mark, I apologize. I meant Mike. I told Mike, what better way to start off the year than some college baseball. So, see y'all on the inside, baby. Yo, look at the line to get in. This is crazy. This is crazy. There's actually two lines to get in. There's one over there. There's one inside right now. Tons of people. Everywhere. I was down there towards Georgia baseball. And we're just standing. We can pretty much walk wherever we want to, stand wherever we want to. So I'm probably going to end up going back that way and just chilling back there. Right now, it is three to nothing. So Georgia Southern is beating Georgia three to nothing right now. Awesome. So, yeah, we just got here, right? We're sitting here. And all of a sudden, out of nowhere, I hear somebody say, move. And uh, he had cracked one. They went like right here. So, uh, yeah. It's actually packed, though. Good game. Let's go. <laughs> so, yeah, this place is packed. Full of people. Just full of people everywhere. Everywhere. It's been a long time since I've been somewhere where I've seen this many people. Just, it's crazy. Lovely. Now we gotta find our way back around. So, so baseball park food review. Got a hamburger, cheeseburger, got some fries. Michael got fries. Michael got barbecue sandwich and ranch potato wedges. Yep. How's the barbecue sandwich? Good. Yeah. That was good. Yeah. So, I'll come back and let you know what's up. Also, we're winning now, ten to uh, eight. So let's go, dogs. So we switched up our spots. We were sitting up there. Oh, by the way, Mike, thoughts on the food? Yeah, mine was really good too. Uh, it was just too much food; couldn't eat it all. But uh, yeah, we switched up spots, so let me turn this around. So now we're over here on the little berm. The bulldogs are up ten to seven, and I'm hoping that a fly ball comes this way, a foul ball comes this way. It'd be pretty awesome. Come on, give me a foul ball right here while I'm filming. <laughs> been a good game we're up 10 to 7 in the bottom of the seventh oh he just walked him let's go let's go yo let's go grand slam grand slam let's go baby grand slam two out grand slam let's go dog so they just announced the attendance a little over 6,000 people, which is an SRP Park uh, hick, uh, record. So not only has it been a crazy game, good game, but we set a record tonight. Attendance. Let's go. So it is the, what are we in? Uh, top of the eighth. No, but, yeah, top of the eighth. Uh, we are up 15 to 7. And we got some other thing to do tonight. We got to go to Walmart, and that closes at 11. So we're going to have to go now. So, uh, all right, boys, let's get out of this. It's now 15 to 11. There is uh, two strikes, two outs. Come on now, let's get out of this. 
Oh, come on, Blue. Let's go. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. 15 to 11. Get out of that inning. Let's go. Let's go. So we got to go. <laughs> We're sitting on the back side of the golf cart. Facing backwards. Yeah. This guy's got a headlight out. He has like two other backup ones. It's kind of weird filming the car behind you. Yeah, I know, right? Part of the way we don't have to walk. Yeah, a good part where you don't have to walk, which is amazing. Ooh. When we left, it was uh, 15 to 11, so hopefully we pulled it off. No dogs. We're now walking back to the car, which. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. And I uh, got out of the way. Hope you enjoyed the game. What up, fam? It's Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. This will be the last, I think. No, I'll probably go till Friday and then put it out and then do a Monday through Friday or a Saturday through Friday type thing. But, yeah, welcome back to the video. Welcome back to the vlog. Right now, we are out here at Langley Pond. Langley Pond, one of the world's largest man-made ponds in the United States, which is pretty cool. If I'm not mistaken, it could be one of the world's largest man-made ponds in Georgia. But I could be wrong. I know it has something to do with that, but it's actually really nice out here. It's gorgeous. It's a beautiful day. We'll go walk down there in just a minute. Don't know how far it goes, but we're going to go look around and check out the pond. So without further ado, you don't want to see me. I'm going to show you the pond and uh, the area is really nice. So enjoy. I'm actually out here on the little dock. Out here on the lake. I mean the pond, sorry, not the lake. A little 360 view. Been out here kind of just chilling. Now we're about to go over here to the beach. There's a little beach area. Thought that was a turtle, but it's not. Like a bag of trash. Looks great. I mean, the pond looks great. I keep saying lake. It's not a lake, it's a pond. It looks phenomenal. Now I'm in Aiken over here. 
Saint Andre Bassett, disciple of Saint Joseph, servant of God, he lived a friend of all. For decades, Brother Andre served as the doorkeeper for the organization Holy Cross in Montreal, in Montreal, Quebec. Humble man, welcome to sick and suffering. This is him right here. It's that place where you can actually sit down. Right here, the church. The church is absolutely beautiful. Look at this church. Absolutely gorgeous, man. Seriously, it's a beautiful church. Absolutely gorgeous church. I just forgot when it was founded in 1853. It was built in 1880. The chapel was built in 1880. The historic St. Mary Church was built in uh, 1905. So it was built in 1905. And it's absolutely gorgeous. Architecture is amazing. I love the big arched doorways. Giant windows. It's like a big castle. Ooh. Now on to our next stop. Or wherever we're going to go next. Don't know where that is. We're, I'm just going to keep going places, right? Enjoy the video. Comment down below. So what up, fam? And welcome to another video. Uh, welcome to the rest of the vlog. I'm actually in Granville right now. I'm about to do a uh, big old uh, ghost adventure paranormal investigation right here in Graniteville. Um, with not just the people that work in the that worked in the uh, mills, but also for the train crash victims of 2005, and also for one of the main owners of this entire thing, who supposedly passed away right over here in these um right over here in these uh this pond lake this little river down here so we're about to go find out so uh enjoy go over to that video check it out and uh i'll see you soon